You're no monster. I know what you are. And it's something I fear is much worse. It's the head of yours that gives you away. You're a human through and through. Welcome back to my Masquerader. Hi, if you're new here, my name is Para, your host, and welcome back to Undertale Yellow. Today, we're delivering justice upon this dark world. Literally, because it's the underground. We're finally going to be playing the genocide route, and I can finally bring justice to Clover for all the times that they died. I guess the intro sequence that Flowey wanted to do, where he told me to wait a while because he needs to prepare his intro dialogue, was actually just the intro of Undertale Yellow again, normally. I was expecting him to be all like, oh, do you want to reset and all that stuff? But I guess we already had made a deal on the neutral route. <laughs> wait, does that mean that that was him talking in the storytelling part of this? Oh, I should have read it in his voice. I didn't know. Okay... They said that you can make it easy. You know what? No, I'll keep it all off. See, the thing is, I want to see how far I can make it without making the settings easy. I'm going to get the golden bandana again, so I'm going to be working towards that again. But we're going to go into this freshly just genocide. I just want to see how far I can get without it being on easy mode, because I honestly surprised myself in the neutral route. I didn't think I was going to get that far. Hi, Quova! Oops. That doesn't count, right? Like, did I have to shoot that guy? Oh, hello! Are you alright? You must be wondering what is going on! See, I'm kind of confused now because I wanted to do the genocide route just like I did the pacifist route, but I don't know if I'm gonna voice everything all over again. I don't think I will, I'll just voice the... when everyone starts kind of like hating Clover, so I guess I can skip the Toriel dialogue because it's not like she's gonna see me murder anybody. Um, but then I feel bad because I want to make the genocide route like into its own series. Do not be afraid, little one. I shall guide you to puzzles. Rigged puzzles, but puzzles nonetheless. I'm gonna go this way because I'm taking a different route now, Goat Mom. I'm taking the genocide route. If you wanna see me voice act all of the Toriel things, just watch the pacifist route. Splendid, I'm so proud of you, my child. Don't worry, I'm sure Flowey rigged it. Bye. You know, you did not scream at all for me and that's okay. Oh wait, you did. My child! It's like a lag. My child! It's like, um, like Guardians of the Galaxy scene where he's like, Watch out! But she already got hit by the rock. Do not wander, my child! They might be unfriendly! I'm the unfriendly one now, mother. No more shall I take this yellow root of mine. I shall take the dark side now. No, my paper! Apparently someone said that that paper was the, like, wanted- Or not wanted posters, the missing posters for the children. Okay, so I have to apparently make sure that every single area has an X mark every single time it tries to spawn enemies in. I got it, alright. You should know this. I mean, I think you know. I think you know that I know, but okay. It's kind of weird looking him in the face. It's okay, now I'm on his side now. We can be friends. I don't know if I have to, like, scour everything for the enemies. Like, don't hide from me. Accept your fate. You have to be back here anyway, because at this number... Okay. Do I have to make sure everybody hears then? Just gotta keep it cool. Just realized, can I dash? Oh no. I always wonder if I can dash, like, outside of boss battles. And I just never realized it before. Okay. How many times do I have to do this so I can kill everybody in this area? You know, my question is, why doesn't anyone just, like, passively, uh, fight the bosses? And then, right when they're like, oh, what do you want to do? You just kill them then? Wouldn't that just be so much more easier than trying to fight them hard? Or you can't kill them once you already passively fought them? So is this how it ends? I'm sorry, it is. I have to make sure that you just never come back again. Because, like, I was fighting Axis in the neutral route, and I was just like, why don't I just fight him passively again? and then just kill him when he asks me to do something. I mean, this this little fly guy does stop spawning, right? Because, um, if he just spawns forever, I'm gonna be here forever. Do I even get XP for this? I sure do. I'm gonna be here for the rest of my life. Aha, my level increased. This is such a tiny area. It's crazy to believe that I have to make sure everyone's murdered in this tiny area. Oh, there we go, okay. So I think this section's done. How did I already forget this puzzle? 
Gosh, I have to be very tedious about the genocide route, isn't it? It's like, it's so purposeful. Wait, is there any enemies here? There is! Oh my gosh! You have to like really want the genocide route to get it. You're not gonna get it by accident. You should probably go heal. Since I leveled up, innit? Chloe, I started murdering. Gee, it's getting a little dusty around here, huh? Nothing? Nothing yet? Okay, I haven't killed enough. You're right. I haven't even entered my Batman trial yet. I'm still just like a, a Robin. A rookie. An, an, a B-class villain. Wow, so many flyers I'm killing. I'm so sorry. It's, I don't know why your entire population is this one section of the ruins. It's not my fault. You should have moved out. Expanded your uh, re re relationships. Live somewhere else. When does it end? When does it ever end? I just started. What am I talking about? It's only been 10 minutes. Oh, there we go. Gosh, now it makes me like self-conscious. Like which areas actually had monsters and which ones didn't. <laughs> I don't even remember now. I don't think it had- I don't think this one had any. Is he gonna say anything about me starting to murder everybody? How long has it been? I was wondering if you ever come back. No, too forward. He's talking about another human, right? I feel like I figured out what Dove was talking about and then I just forgot again. Mm -hmm. Even though it has not been that long. Did he kill the other human? If he did kill the other human, I'm sorry mm -hmm. Dove, I'm putting that in your crime. Maybe he'll confess when I fight him. Yeah, I feel like he either sent them off or like he reported them or... They just... You know, died. To be or not to be? Not to be? Is it like pencil sizes? A sharpener would come in handy right about now. Sure would. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot about your attack. If I could just remember everybody's attack, that'd be fantastic, brain. But I have not eaten yet, so my brain has nothing to work at. Okay, I'm gonna just keep killing and see how far I get, and then I'll ask Flowey and see if he says anything, because technically Flowey wanted me to do this, okay? Now we're partners in crime together. Now I no longer repel what Flowey wants. It's so funny to think about that in the beginning stages of this game, like, they put you through the ruins and they give you, like, these attacks that will later be, like, the bigger attacks of the bosses. Why do I keep missing? I'm not gonna buy a boat. Know anyone selling? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, fl fly flyer. Flyer? Like a board flyer? I don't know. Anyway, it's so crazy to think that this is technically a tutorial, and it is a tutorial, but I died so many times here, like, <laughs> that's the crazy part. <laughs> they technically, like... See, now the music changed. I'm not crazy. And the last one, I noticed it too. Like, after a while, it starts changing. Is it because I'm starting to kill everybody? So now it's like the the kill version, the genocide version of that song? Yeah, see, now it's slower. Am I, like, becoming evil? I wonder if it'll be, like, a really dark song by the time... I'm done murdering everyone. Or is the song an indication of how many people are left in this area? Oh, I see. Maybe. You really got some passion there. There's only five of the monsters left, not counting that weirdo. Really? Good luck, pal. Five? Are you sure? I could have sworn this place was humongous. Take some? Yes. You pour yourself a glass, but there is no attendant to take your money. What poor service. Leave a tip? Actually, I will this time. A large amount. You leave 5G in the tip jar. Your conscience feels light as a feather. It sure does after murdering this entire condoli of people. <laughs> yeah, see, now the music's slower. I feel like it changes whatever route you take, right? I want my song to turn, like, really evil. Really Batman-y, you know? Yeah. Something like that. I wanted him gone, but not that way. Well, don't make your wishes too wishable. Oh my gosh. <gasps> it is turning darker. Yes! I'll just tape it back together. What, your body after I murder you? That's not gonna happen. You can't put tapes on bullet wounds. Penicillia. What was your name? Penelia. 
Like she might crack under the pressure. I'm cracking under the pressure. You know how many of you I have to murder? Why are there so many of you? Panilia, you make my life miserable. And you don't even know why. <laughs> I'm the one suffering here, Panilia, not you. Oh. Wow. There's like no music, it's so low. It almost sounds like a phone, like, dialing. But she was so sweet! I know. Just let it happen, Penelia. It's not worth it. I'll free you from your poor, pathetic life that you have left up to this moment. I will make sure that no pain ever reaches your body again. Because you won't have a body, Penelia. Because you'll be dead. I feel so evil. <laughs> the only reason I came back was because I wanted to murder the bo- Wow! That was something! You like my speech? You even came personally? Damn, I didn't think it was gonna summon you! You're a lot stronger than I give you credit for. Those monsters never stood a chance against your skill. What's with that face? Don't even think about killing me, too. I mean, I was a little tempted, but I'm not gonna kill you, boss. Don't worry, I love you, too. Although, I feel like in the end of the game, I'm just gonna turn at him, no? Because I'll be just- I'll just be so bloodthirsty, I'll just kill everything, and then I'll have to kill boss, too? I wanna keep calling him boss. He tried to kill me in the last one! <laughs> Remember, I'm the one keeping you alive. Your life is in my hands. Don't worry, I won't judge you for your actions. Friends don't judge each other, right? I have your back, and you've got mine. So let's get out of here, okay, pal? <gasps> I... I don't have... I don't have a little face! And the music's evil! But nobody came! <gasps> They're scared of me! What the... Oh my gosh... Oh my gosh. Oh no. I, I was gonna go into this, like, not feeling bad. I was gonna be like, no, those people deserved it. Child endangerment, child endangerment. You know, I was like, all oh, child endangerment and, like, neglectment. But, um, I feel like I'm not gonna enjoy this as much as I thought I was gonna enjoy this. You know, I was gonna pretend to be evil, but I didn't think they would actually become evil. <laughs> Yeah, don't look at me, buddy, because I'm- I'm a little- What is this? Why do they appear every time I start monologuing? Oh no, it's the same. I need more rest. <laughs> I'm gonna give you the rest you always wanted, Dolph. <laughs> I don't even have a face anymore! My little schmuckums! Did I do this? But nobody came. Wait, the scroll and everybody else, they're not gonna show up? Wait, did the pictures change? It was like a cat before, but now it just looks like... Like a- like a human? Kind of? Wow! It sure is quiet around here! You're telling me, buddy! I was expecting to fight tooth and nail for everything in this place! I gotta say, it's a bit nice with no disturbances. Well, nothing left to do here, I guess. Let's keep going. <laughs> the music's gone! I- I freaked the whole game over, Flowey! Is he- is, is he even gonna show up? The bat, I mean. <gasps> it's like I have VIP privilege now. Let's keep moving. Yeah, I don't even know why I clicked you. I have nothing to save. Nobody's showing up. Nobody's fighting me. Oh, that's great. It's fantastic. Oh. But nobody came! Nobody's gonna come to my birthday party now! Or my Christmas party! Or my Clover party! I don't know, cowboy party? Does that mean I still get the frog? I do, right? Fighting the bat wasn't... It wasn't like part of the mission. A proud feeling. Yeah, the proud feeling of a murderer! The bat's not even here anymore. 
I'm just glad I didn't have to kill those guys then. They just like ran on their own. But my little squishy face is gone. Ah. Uh -huh. uh. uh -huh. Um. I don't know who you are, but I ask you, please leave. Oh, nobody. <laughs> I'm never leaving again. In fact, you're never leaving here again. Wait, is that like a shortcut? I'm wondering. Hold on. Like, if I go this way, can I reach it faster? And that's why this is here? Yes? Kind of? I feel like it's the same amount of time. You know, I was expecting to joke this whole time because I didn't think it was gonna, like, change this much, but, like, the music changed and nobody's showing up and I'm, like, happy, but not the way that I was in the neutral route happy. You know what I mean? You know, that was the accents of my consequences. Unhappy. But this is what I wanted. Stop showing it to me! Nobody's gonna come! <laughs> You're like, look at look at what you did. Although it is quite interesting that they took the, the faster approach and just made me like kill a couple rooms and then... They didn't like make me kill everyone in the beginning intro because that just- that would take forever. Let's get down there. Gosh, the music's so... Dead. I hear movement in the distance. Intimidating presence fills the ruins. Do you think that little dust bunny will still be there? Okay, so I can't kill the bunny, right? Even though I am on the genocide route, I think I already have everything for this area, considering that I've turned as evil as Darth Vader. I'm like Darth Vader when they were all like, Master Anakin, what, what do we do? And then he like pulls the lightsabers out on them and he just kills everyone in that- all the children in that temple. This is what I feel like. Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to kill Microfogret. I'm so glad I can't. Oh no, it's the slow one. It's the slow one! You know, I can't tell which one's worse. The slow one, the fast one? Oh my goodness. Hopefully that doesn't ruin my genocide route. Even though it's way easier to get the genocide route than I thought. The microfogrits are waving goodbye. Really? You still like me? That's glad. At least somebody's coming to my cowboy party. No, I, the dust bunny's gone. Alright, let's go fight Dolph and see what kind of information I can take from him before I murder him at his own house. <laughs> Flowey, anything to say? Oh wait, hold on one second. I almost forgot. Don't step on the flowers. I may be a murderer, but I will still not step on those flowers. Howdy. Not too far now. Just gotta deal with that downer. Then you're out of the ruins. See you on the other side, pal. Okay, nothing to say about my murderous streak. Damn, that means I could be mean now. I don't have to answer anybody's questions. You're still following me. I thought I made it clear that I want to be left alone. I don't understand. You... You look just like them. So you did murder another human. Is this some sort of hunting? Or have you come to finish the job? Retreating here wasn't enough, so you hunted me down? No comment. Technically, I am hunting you down. And I just started to accept my reality. The cruelty. Whatever I did to you that day was not my intention. It was only... Never mind. Words aren't enough. I guess not. Taste my gun, Dolph. I... I don't want to fight anybody. But you've invaded my home. It's true. I have. The exit is blocked and you can't stay here. I will not allow it. Only one thing to do. <sighs> I'm so sorry, Delve. We were on good terms once. Once. You know, it's been quieter since you showed up. I suppose I should thank you. Why, because you don't like your neighbors? Wait, is it the same attacks for the genocide? I finally got my wish. 
Or maybe it was just a happenstance. Hap happenstance? So I thought you were writing kids books, not literature. Well, you're not gonna write anything now. Everywhere I go, dust keeps clinging to my cape. I'm sorry to assume, but... They're all gone, aren't they? Oh, right, because they all turn to dust once I kill them. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, man, dude, that's hard. My bad. Why would you need an easy mode for this, then? For the, like, secret boss of the genocide, the one that's really hard? I know I should thank you, but it is what I asked for. But I never wanted to hurt anybody. I... Yeah, I know you didn't. I did, though! <laughs> I'm kidding, Dal. I've been here, like, so many times. You don't even remember. I can't help but think it's all my fault. Maybe my wish brought you here. Maybe I just needed to take a nap. When I wake up, you'll be gone, won't you? Yeah, you're just a ghost of my memories. Yeah, exactly. I didn't kill anyone, Dolph. You didn't kill anyone. Nobody killed anything. We're good. Well, I remember when I couldn't get this attack right. I still can't, but like, I couldn't move sideways because I didn't know how to. Turns out you got to press two keys at once. Hey, if you aren't real, then is all this actually my fault? I miss them all now. Yeah. So glad this music doesn't change though. Oh. Uh oh. I. I think I believe you're real now. I have grown awfully tired, but if I sleep, then wake up, this won't be undone. So maybe, maybe I just won't wake up. Whoa. I earned 120 XP? Well, your love increased? Hell yeah, I did, baby! What the heck? Wait, doesn't that mean that I can go into this room now? Oh, that's it? I was expecting like a weird ceremony thing for the person he killed. There is a book of neatly written paragraphs on the desk. They all appear to be very similar. Okay, what was he trying to hide so badly? A fine oak chest. An old gramophone. You spare yourself by not playing the record on it. <laughs> Funny. It looks like Delve's diary. This could contain private information. Read it. Oh, I'm sorry, Dolph, but you're dead, and I did respect you for the past two lives, so surely I have enough merits to go to your journal. Yes, please. You open the diary up. I just need to know what happened fully, because I always, like, w I'm always, like, iffy what happened in Dolph's story, because I'm, like, kind of understand everybody else's, but Dolph, like, always messes me up. There's only one entry. It seems new. Today began like every other day. I got out of bed, brushed my fangs, and had a nice bowl of corn for breakfast. Ugh! Just corn, though? Pops made a very funny joke at Broom's expense, and we all had a laugh. I put on my cloak and went out for my daily walk. I noticed another blue corn had popped up in your cornfield today. I always feel bad for discarding the special corn, but I can't risk getting sick. Blue corn! So the blue soul died, and that's why there's blue flowers everywhere that I'm not supposed to step on? The blue human? Anyways. Wait, what did blue stand for again? Is that kindness or perseverance? Something interesting happened a bit later. I overheard Flyer and Penelia talking about me. Hold on, I have the picture from Twin Runes. Hold on, one second. Oh, Integrity! The one that Axis killed! But... But they... But, but they said they got murdered over at Waterfall, not the ruins. I heard... I overheard Fly and Penelia talking about me. About us. You were friends with the blue human and then they went out and Axis murdered them? They said they were concerned for me. They said I'd talk to myself. Penelia then chimed in and commented on my advice and gifts to you. My signs. They said you don't exist. That isn't true. You do. 
I know you do. You reached out to me when I needed it most. Helped me cope with the past. How could they be so mean? What do they know? I don't need them. Because... Because I have you. It's been one year. I'm still waiting. The entry ends there. They're dead! Oh, Axis killed them! <laughs> That's so sad! But now I know the full story. Like, I knew it was... It seems horribly out of tune. Like, like I knew, but... Like, I didn't want to really know, you know? Oh my gosh. Does that mean I have to kill Pop, too? There's a balloon floating slowly inside. You untie it and inhale some of the contents. <gasps> you now sound funny. You no longer sound funny. You are a murderer, Clover! My gosh, am I gonna, like, blow that door down or something? Childish pictures? You're a child! What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, folks, this is gonna be a sad one. Oh, Flowey opens it. Oh, great. Howdy! Were you expecting that? I'm a little more helpful than you may have thought. Anything you can't do by yourself is my job. Anyway, great job getting through here. Boy, am I glad to be on your side. Get ready because we have a long journey ahead. This is going to be so much fun. I'll see you on the other side, pal. Boy. This makes me feel great about myself. I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Is anyone going to try to stop me as I exit the, 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 the Snowden area? Am I going to be hunted down? Like, what does this mean now? I'm an animal! A monster! I'm an eldritch being! Howdy! Enjoying the scenery? Before you continue, I just wanted to let you know. No one from out here really goes in the ruins. Now that we're out here, well, how should I put it? No one will ever notice a few mincing monsters and a little extra dust. All your actions up till now... They're as good as sealed away. So you're telling me I can get the neutral ending if I wanted to? Our little secret. So, if you want, you could change everything right now. Run around the rest of the underground like nothing happened. Just remember, killing some lonely ruined residents was one thing. But you're outside now, pal. There's no erasing anymore, so think carefully. Or don't, because that sounds boring. Whatever you pick, I'm rooting for you, pal. Man... You didn't even ask my name. You've been thinking over what I said? Due respect to your decision-making process, but would you mind hurrying it up? It's a cold out here, and I don't fancy freezing. I just wanted to save, man. Level oh, 5 already? Jeez Louise. Right. Someone said that the robots don't give you XP. I just... I didn't reach max, like, levels. I just... just the robots don't give you XP. Yeah. Maybe this trip wasn't a good idea. Why, because I'm here? I'm starting to have second thoughts about this as a honeymoon spot. It doesn't really feel safe. I can't tell my wife, though. It would just upset her. No, she thinks the same thing. Because of me. The atmosphere seems colder. Isn't there some, doesn't it seem like there's something behind this rock? An annoying boulder blocks the cave. Yeah, it feels like there should be like a secret thing here. But maybe I'm just crazy, but that rock doesn't look right. Oh no. I can't change my ways, Flowey. I'm a murderer through and through. Igloo, igloo! Man, I can't wait to <laughs> I can't wait to hear this music change. Igloo, igloo! I know, I know you're an igloo, I know. It's deliberate. I am actually murdering an igloo, I know. I can't believe I murdered Pops. A fishing hole. I mean, it's my own fault. I was curious. Ow. You caught me with my- Wait, can I do it with the Z? 
I can. I'm gonna say you caught me with my fingers on the enter key. Oh, I did get a box here. Huh. Did I just never in my life see that box before? No, I must have seen it in the pacifist route, but I just forgot about it. Wait, does that mean I can see my face again? I haven't checked. Oh man, I keep getting distracted. Ow! I mean igloo noises! Yeah, my little Thanos baby. Predicating the whole population over here single-handedly. Nope, still can't see my face. Yeah, that's probably what it scared the honeymoon people. Gosh, why do you guys all have to live in the same area? You know, you should really go out, expand your family tree a little bit. I feel bad. This is like the last of their kind. Oh gosh, Marlette's gonna know I'm murdering everybody. Okay. Alright, got everyone here. Isn't that just great, Clover? We're doing it! We're, we're passing justice because they killed the other humans! Gee, you sure are living on the edge! What a freaking weirdo! Hey, I heard that. I guess they did attack you first. Can't get in trouble for self-defense! Knew it. There was one just slunking around here. I can sniff you now. I know when there's enemies afoot. Potential victims, I mean. Sorry, not enemies anymore. They were my enemies when I was playing the pacifist route because technically I wasn't defending myself. Now I'm deliberately looking for them. Yay, I leveled up. I feel so good about myself. Damn, I can two-shot these guys now. Is this what Anakin felt like when he was committing war crimes? <laughs> Anakin was just like going through all the... Going through all the people he murdered and he was all like, Finally, you know how much I hated you? How much strife you gave me? Is Marlette gonna say anything here regarding the deaths of the people now? Recalibrate the lava rock puzzle. Check. It should hold together for a few uses at least, and that's good enough for me. Next stop, Honeydew Resort! Nothing. Huh. Oh, she doesn't know yet. She was too busy recalibrating the puzzle. I saw someone running away from something. I want to follow them, but I can't. I'm scared. Yeah, they're running away from me. That's right, little buddy, it was me. Thought I saw some dust lying around. Might have just been snow. At least, that's what everyone else would think. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm doing. I know what you're doing. You wanted me to do this. In the last one, you were all like, Oh, you couldn't just follow the plan. I'm doing it, boss. I'm following the plan. Isn't this what you wanted, Flowey? I read something in a book once. It said, If life comes at you too fast, Press X and take it slow. Whatever that means. I guess that's good if I want to like maneuver slowly around things. I never really saw the point in that until now. Because I'm more experienced now. Oh yeah, ice pellets are worth it. Ow! Now I have a headache. Bye-bye! Is there anyone else in this area besides Insomniac? Snowcastle. There is! Yeah, say I remembered. Ah, more little igloo guys? No, I told you to move, but I'm still murdering your people! <laughs> Flower's just watching this like, what the heck? I mean, at least they're doing their job, but they're a little... You know, a little more dense than I thought they were gonna be. Now I have a headache! Huh? What? I think I nodded off. Yeah, I just killed your friend, but you were too busy sleeping, little buddy. So if you think about it, this is just an alternative attack of- a faster attack of that pencil. It's all just teaching you how to fight, one after the other. I never wondered this before, but do all Deltarune and like Undertale games have like almost the same fighting mechanic in each single one and that's why people are like so good at it going into it? We just kind of like remember the same sort of pattern of attacks? Hmm. Does that mean I'll be amazing at other fan games now, or...? Wherever I do something else? See, now the music changed again. I guess this means that I'm clearing everybody from the area out? Music's pretty-
pretty good though. Is that guitar the cries of the innocent that I've taken from this world? I would gladly listen to that. Wow, kid! You mean business! What's that? 15? 16? Really? You've been keeping count? Very impressive! Am I done? Sure am! Oh, hey, Mo. I wouldn't come out. This isn't safe anymore. Am I gonna murder Mo? A new customer? Bam! I'm scared for him. Who am I? Nobody of note, you know? Just the best darn salesman ever! Wham! I'm Mo. Anyways, the fact that you tried to get your mitts on this mug could only mean one thing. You're looking for a delicious little something to hit the spot, right? Of course I know your type. So, you want this here beverage? Yes, give it to me, Mo. No, you don't! Have I piqued your interest? No. You have to keep up with the times, pal. I'll let you look at them for free. Call it a holiday special. You're not gonna get murdered? Yeah, I'll enjoy that pop, buddy. Right? I forgot I was murdering people. I know, Cone! No Cone no like small stranger! Yeah, No Cone don't like me too. I don't like me too, No Cone. Don't worry. So I guess the music becomes like this, and then disappears completely when I've murdered everyone in the area and everyone's petrified of me. My love increased! Oh, yay! Open up. Open up! Oh. Still can't fit in there even though I'm a murderer now? Hi, Ice Wolf. Home, 238. Home, 239. At this pace, Ice Wolf is ready for a new job in no time. Yeah, you keep it up, buddy. I think all your neighbors are running for the fields, but don't worry about that. It must be some crazy little kid wearing a cowboy hat. No, it couldn't be me. I don't know what you're talking about. They're safe, right? Oh boy, OG, a customer. I'm nervous. I'm the mail whale from the Underground Postal Service. Haven't heard of us? We're the best! For short, just call us UGPS. So I hear you're new to the underground? How you ask? Well, word sure gets around. The underground is great and it keeps getting better. Cause I brought for you your very first letter. That was a special letter from us to you. Do you feel welcome now? I hope you do. Isn't the mail system a wonderful innovation? If you ever want to use it, just come to the station. They look just like this, and they scattered all around. If you want to receive some mail, find one and give a shout. We assure you, they are conveniently situated. Here at the UGPS, we're anything but dated. Talking and sharing, all using mail. From your underground friends. But that's all for this whale. Now, I must be off. The whale mustn't be late. See you later on your journey, mate. Oh, I love that whale so much. I'm so glad you didn't kill her, Clover. It's my favorite whale. There was like one no cone here, but is there more? Yeah, there is. They really thought they could escape my wrath. There wasn't any behind me that I missed, was there? Hey, Insomniac. What's up? Don't need to be so crass. Nah, don't worry about it. I'm just helping you go to sleep. Here, I'll even sing you a lullaby. Go to sleep and good night. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh, it really worked so fantastically, huh, Clover? Oh, it sounded like a phone dial again. Just to sound like a phone dial. Ma, ma, ma. The number you have contacted is not available. <laughs> Please leave a message at the beep. No wait, the com the, the number you have contacted is no longer in service. But nobody came. <gasps> okay, I think I did it. 
I'm evil now. The music. I did this. Wow. Same effect? This place went from pleasant to eerie real quick. That must be a new record or something. On the bright side, you won't have to pay for coffee anymore. I won't? Have to pay for coffee? The remnants of a snowman. I did that to that snowman. I did that to this whole town. <laughs> they never saw it coming. The moment they saw this hat on the horizon, they should have ran. I was gonna say, didn't I kill anybody? Anyway, and Mo would be a fool to be here. He is gone. <laughs> a smart fool, that one. He wouldn't dare show his face around here ever again. If he knows what's best for him. Let me never see if that man Mo. Or he. Shall never see again. What about those cups, though? Am I gonna murder those cups? Oh no, the cups never showed up! Oh my gosh, everyone left. Welcome to the Honeydew Resort. North, the Honeydew Lodge. Northwest, the Honeydew Hot Springs. East, exit to Snowden. Cool. Yeah. Wow, you guys really booked it. Take! Steal! Wait a minute. You took 60 G- <gasps> Oh my gosh, I am a criminal. I'm gonna talk to those people in a second. Let me just, uh... Go put things in my box. Sorry, I, I kind of need that pin. I felt bad at that point, but it it's good defense. Not that I would need it. Maybe, maybe you would need it? Because... Well, they're all dead. Yeah. Okay, let me just go get that egg and then I'll I'll be I'll be back. A small hot spring. The water is getting cold. It's a cup of coffee. Take it. Oh, it's not deliciously good-looking most sexy coffee you've ever seen. This whole situation is terrible. It's too depressing to play music now. I hope everyone's okay. We were in the middle of our set when everyone started leaving. At first, I thought our music was that bad, but then they said there was danger. Surely it's not what I think it is. Not again. It's a human, isn't it? This is a strange turn off of events. I wonder where everyone ran off to. I don't suppose you know. No. No, how would I know? Yum? How would I know where everyone ran off to? That's just ridiculous. Boy. Just so ridiculous. There's a single mitten on the ground. It seems as if it was recently discarded. Yep, that's the mission I just can't seem to complete, Clover. I just can never seem to get that guy unstuck. It's a regular torch. This is spooky. <laughs> what did I do to this town? Can't tell if it's the temperature or the atmosphere, but wow. Sure is cold. You should get a move on. Uh-huh. Did that say level 8? Sure did. That was not max level. Love that. That means Marlette knows, because she's not here anymore. She must have grabbed everybody and ran. Does Marlette know about the other human, or was she too young? My gosh, it is deafening. No! 
Oh, I thought I was gonna have to kill those three kids that liked playing stand on each other's shoulders. Take a look inside the barrel and find some coffee beans. Take it. So now I have to read everything in an evil tone. Even this puzzle seems evil. Oh. Okay. I'm so evil the ball's depressed. Oh! No, that counted. I mean, now I know everyone was so hesitant with Clover. I mean, they act like they already had like a situation like this before. They already have like human trauma. I didn't even realize that this is like a pretty much like a nuke entering your country or like a terrorist or like a murderer. Serial killer enters your country. This is what it's like. I never realized that's what all the freaking monsters were feeling every single time they saw Clover. Oh, I'm pretty sure half of them did not know I was a human. So it really was just straight up bullying, let's be honest. Your gun now smells delightful. Sure is. What's Marla gonna say now? Oh my goodness! Did you get left behind? Might I ask your name? Clover. Hmm. Darth Vader the serial killer? I'm kidding. <laughs> Not on the resident list. Um. See, this is tough. I can't leave my post. I'm supposed to wait here until this bad person comes. The troublemaker who caused all this, you know? But I can't just leave you to find the others alone. You're a child. I could never do that. Okay, how about we hurry and catch up with the others? Then I come back and no one will ever know. Ready? Hey, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, I was gonna say yes, but Clover's so bloodthirsty. There's no need for fighting now. We have to get going if we want to catch up. Come on. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, Marlette. Ow! What are you doing? I understand if you're scared, but you have to trust me. I'm with the Royal Guard. It's my job to make sure you're safe. Ow, ow, ow! Look, I get it. You're scared and don't know what to do. Everyone is. But you can't take that out on me. If you go around hurting everyone all the time, well, no one will ever help you. You're right, they never will. Hey, snap out of it. Do you do this to everyone who tries to be nice to you? No one has ever tried to be nice to me. You, you do, don't you? You're the one they are running from, aren't you? I, I don't know what to do. I've been so naive. You're just a kid. Yeah. Well, I'll be honest with you. My handbook says nothing about the specific situation. However, I do know that something similar has happened before. They put a stop to that, so... It's up to me to put a stop to this. Uh-oh. Extra attacks, little fancy pants, aren't we? I knew Marlette was holding back. I freaking knew it. So you can take a hit. I'm sorry to hear that. That means I'll just have to hit harder. You know, I'm almost glad you attacked me when you did. If you had waited, I might have told you where the others went. But now you'll never find them. Okay. This whole thing is a tragedy. And the saddest part is that there was no need for it. They say monsters are made of love, hope, and compassion. Who would have agreed to help you in a heartbeat? No, you wouldn't. You would have sacrificed me. You would have made Sarova take me all the way, and then you would have taken me to Asgore where I would have died, Marlette. That's the saddest part, Marlette. But you wouldn't understand that. 
You're no monster. I know what you are. And it's something I fear is much worse. It's the hat of yours that gives you away. You're a human through and through. Sure am. Oh my gosh. Okay, I guess after Marlette, this is where we're stopping the video because uh, I feel like I'm gonna be a little wild with Marlette. Gee, those monsters sure are cruel. And who is their main influence? The king? Oh, who is their main influence? The king. I want you to know, I don't hate your kind. There's gotta be nice humans out there. Or at least somewhat reasonable humans. I hope that was you. You're still trying? Pretty... Determined there, aren't you? Luckily, so am I. Is that the sand attack? <laughs> am I just wetting the sand attack? What was that? What was that, Marlette? I'm pretty sure I've seen that attack before, but with giant skulls and lasers. And it was in Delta Traveler, so uh, don't try to fool me, Marlette. I know a weak willed monster when I see one. So do I. It's beatable. I feel like that was the ending of her fight right there, and I died because I didn't know where those feathers were going. you back down <sighs> you're telling me Marlette I'm out of islands so you know if you kill me it's over I feel like I'm so close to the end, though. I can't die now. Ah, yeah. I bring that upon myself. Okay, now I know all the attacks until leading up to that point, so it shouldn't be that bad. Also figured out how to deal with a couple of them. I'm not quitting, but I just want to know what it would be like on easy mode, okay? Because I'm a little bit tired. Just a little bit. Yeah, sure, just put everything on. Why not? <clears throat> What's the world going to do with everything on? I just want to know what easy mode looks like, because I've already fought Marlette so many times on hard mode, technically. I just, I've already memorized Marlette's fights. So I wonder if it's gonna be harder. Or maybe her health would just be more down? Nope. I wonder what makes it an easy mode. The battle, probably. All right, let's see. Okay, same thing.
Okay. Oh, thank goodness. Oh my gosh, I thought I was gonna have to do that all over again. I don't know what easy mode did. I feel like nothing changed. Nothing changed, obviously. So I don't know if the easy mode is just for the harder bosses and not the Marlette bosses, but... You win. I'm done attacking, so please. Lower your weapon. Is this the sort of thing where you're gonna tell me to lower my weapon, but then I can't, cause, you know, then that would make me the neutral route? Thank you. <sighs> my handbook says this thing. There's no shame in tactical retreat. I've never been sure what that applied to, but I think... I think that time is now. You're not off the hook, Clover. Unless you decide right now to change your ways. The Royal Guard will find you. It could be me or someone much, much worse. How your life plays out from this moment is up to you. I don't know what the humans taught you, but a child your age shouldn't be corrupted by violence. Please, please choose wisely. Bye. Told you she wasn't gonna die in this fight. Okay, there's a notebook on the counter titled My Puzzle Blueprints. This must be where Marlette sketches her puzzle ideas. Good thing she didn't die. Let's head on back to the river up ahead. We'll soon be out of here. Okay. Although I must confess it has been a couple of weeks since I've come back to this. I was working on the car timeline and I just left this video like in the works. Howdy! What a day! I mean, wowie! It's the same damn thing. Congrats, pal! You beat your first royal guard. Though, I'm not sure how she got promoted past Feather Duster. Have to give her some credit though. This boat looks like your ticket out of the cold. If you follow this current, you'll be living it up in Hotland before you know it. Now, there's no time to waste. See you later, Clover. How do I get there? Just steal her boat straight up? Oh, okay. Guess it's gonna be one lonely boat ride for me. Gosh, I put sprint on all the time and I'm so fast. Get on the boat? Yes. Oh, I'm just a little guy now. A murderous little two-inch fella. This is nice. You know, maybe Warlet was just ruining the mood, you know? Close your eyes. Let the music seep into you. The beautiful water current. Nothing but violence. In your mind. Coughing up Coughin all up that all dust that you dust killed. killed. While we ride down ride this down wonderful, this wonderful waterfall. waterfall. While the current, While the current slowly, slowly gets quicker. Gets but quicker. Don't, don't open your eyes. Open it's your okay. Eyes. You're, it's fine. Fine. You're, fine. you're fine. You're fine. Nothing's fine. happening. Fine. Nothing's, Nothing's wrong. wrong. We're just chilling on a boat. It's perfectly fine. Just you and your little medley. Just a nice little folklore. That's all we're hearing. Gosh, every freaking time. Even in a murderous stage, I can't just, like, grow the powers of flight. Why, right, good morning, little murder child. Oh, I don't get any raisins. Howdy, Clover. Sorry about all this. I'm usually pretty good at judging where to go next. The raft must have been a trap set by that guard. You outsmarted her, though. I'm impressed. Even so, you look pretty beat up. Let me take care of that. Thank you, thank you. Alright, this is where I'm gonna end this video. Um, the genocide route is pretty surprising, but I mean, not what I wasn't expecting. Except the fact that all- a lot of the bad guys are just like disappearing halfway through and I'm not- and I'm not like bumping into people that I thought I would have to fight. That- I think that's the shocking part. They all kind of just like despawn, which is really nice, kind of. Cause you know, I don't have the whole place to myself and I don't have to be scared for stepping on booby traps like snake pots or something. Oh yeah, I'm gonna murder that snake, 100%. But yeah, that was Undertale Yellow Genocide Brow, part one. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying it. I... I mean, is it wrong to say I'm enjoying it? Because, I mean, I am. The power is in my hand. So thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for coming to my masquerade. If you want to see the full playlist of Undertale Yellow, I have the pacifist and the neutral and special route there. So I'm going to stick the genocide just under that playlist as well. So if you want to go check it out, the playlist is on the screen now. If you also want to see the playlist for Delta Traveler, 
I'm really proud of that series. I think it's really fun. I can't wait to see more sections come out. But yeah, it's not complete, but I really like that one. If you want to see that one, that one's on the screen as well. See you later, masqueraders. Bye!